Good morning, folks. Running a little late. This is that comet that had some of you freaked out. It's Comet C-2012 V4, and it is nowhere near the Earth. When I tilt this here, you can see it lines up with the Earth, and I've got the JPL diagram position so that if you extend that line towards us to cross Earth's orbit on this side, that's where the Stereo B spacecraft is. So despite the fact that this thing is farther away from Earth than the Sun, because of the positioning, it did appear to be coming right at Earth as it crossed the line of sight. Had a seven-pointer yesterday in the Banda Sea of Indonesia. Also had a six-pointer in the Maluka Sea and a very unusual tremor in northern Canada. Had a nuclear reactor shut down due to low water levels. Southern Europe is taking severe rainfall. Here's the last 24 hours. You should be able to see the remaining cyclonic low over Greece while a new one invades from the Atlantic. South Indian Ocean. Cyclone Claudia not doing much dangerous. However, see how far the tail comes east. That's actually what is affecting Western Australia at the moment. Thunderstorm watches continue while New Zealand should be enjoying some nicer weather. Snowfall totals piling up due to winter storm Caesar, but the southern effect zone is not to be left out. High winds, flooding, and tornadoes were present as the convergence swept across the southeast. Pressure map shows all low pressure up north. There is another system coming in from the North Pacific, and the wind map shows all wind headed for those lows, which should warm us up a bit. It'll be welcome after that last low brought cold Canadian air all the way to Guatemala. Yikes. Cosmic rays are elevated again, but no higher than they were yesterday. Solar wind speed dropping near 300 kilometers per second, which is that line of extreme low. Density is a bit elevated, however. If you can get out this morning before sunrise, the moon is conjoining Venus and Mercury today. Two days from now, it will swing in for a new moon nine hours after making its monthly close approach to the Earth. If the active regions of focus look smaller than they did yesterday, they are. They went into decay right after the news and are losing danger. Had a little plasma filament pop off the southeastern limb, not coming at Earth. Got a corona hole up north and down south. Let's hope we've got the quakes out of our system. Eyes open. No fear. It's 6.40 a.m. Eastern Time, and that's the news. Be safe, everyone.